when the car's not acting very nice and you're hanging on for dear life at the speedway, doing everything you can just to survive and get through the race. You know, it's kind of like on the fertility side of things, in the beginning, that's what you're doing. You're doing everything you can and you're just surviving day to day because of the heartbreak and stuff that you go through. It was the most painful five years of our lives, um, just not knowing what was to come. We were told that I had zero chance of, of being able to produce a healthy egg. It was time to give up. When we sat there, with the previous clinic. Just a lot of things didn't add up to me and I just didn't feel like we got, you know, attention to detail. That's so important, everything in life. And that's when we started thinking, maybe we're not getting the care that we need. And so that's when we went to Midwest to get a second opinion and it was a game changer. The moment we walked into Midwest facility, I just immediately felt good about something. And for me, I'm a big believer as well. If you feel good about something, there's a reason why. They truly look at you as though you're the only patient in the clinic. The day that Hudson was born was, well, it was the best day. It was the best day. It meant that we were, you know, finally parents. We had our Hudson. Yeah, you know, I think I'm the luckiest person in the world right now because I get an amazing son great family, uh, get to do 500. I think what we envision is uh, and hope is that um, Hudson would follow in the footsteps of Dr. Culver and become a fertility doctor and that would be pretty special to see him do that.